What is going on guys? It's your boy CJR Sports and today we're coming back to you with another NFL video. But before we get started, you know the drill. Make sure you like this video and subscribe to this channel. We are on the road to 100 subscribers. By the way, you guys are absolutely killing it with the views. Uh, the Jimmy Garoppolo video at almost 250 views. And you, uh, some videos are almost at 100 views now. You guys are absolutely killing it. Make sure you go watch all my content and go hit the notifications button so you don't miss anything that I upload. Now, let's get right into this video. And so yesterday, that the video got posted today about Gronk potentially coming back and uh, Derek Brooks' thoughts about it. Now, Mike Reese, a Patriots reporter, uh, saw uh, Rob Gronkowski and was able to ask him a few questions about if he would return to the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, even if Tom Brady would ask him. This is what he said. Um, he goes, I would not go back to football. No, he told Mike Reese of ESPN that Rob Gronkowski has already unretired once to go back to go play with the Bucks and Tom Brady. But he says that he is done with football, that he loves the game and loved the opportunities that the, ga uh, the game was able to give him. But he is on to bitter, uh, bigger and better things in the business world, working with his brother and his shaker company and some of the stuff that him and his dad's going to be working with. So it looks like Rob, Gr uh, Rob Gronkowski and Tom Brady have been the best, you know, quarterback tight end pairing in history, but it sounds like Gronk truly is done with football and the NFL. Even if he said, like, even he already came out publicly in saying that he would say no to Tom to come out of retirement. My now, my personal opinion, I will never. Rob, uh, Tom Brady retired than unretired. I think anything can happen. I think, like, just like Tom had a change of heart, I think Gronk could have a change of heart. Maybe the Bucks go on a big run. That week 10 bye week is looking real juicy. Tom hits him up and, like, Gronk, you want to come play, you know, a few games, maybe win another Super Bowl, and then we'll both run off in the sunset, you know, retire together, be in the same, you know, uh, you know, a uh, Hall of Fame class, you know, we can do all that. But it seems like he will not play again. I still have my suspicions I because I think with all the news being as new as it is, I feel like he kind of has to come out and say, I'm retired, I'm fully retired, I'm not coming back. Be, I believe he said it the first time when he retired from the New England Patriots. So... I know he says he's done with football and that it would be a no done deal uh, if Tom even asked him to come back. But I still have my suspicions about Rob Gronkowski playing football. I, again, don't count it out. I think there's a reason why the Tampa Bay Buccaneers haven't really went out and got a tight end. They still have Cameron Bright on their uh, roster. They drafted a tight end. They haven't went out and signed a tight end. And that's going to be Tom Brady's safety blanket, especially with uh, Chris Godwin going to take a few weeks to kind of get going. They're going to need um, a very good tight end, you know, to pair up with Mike Evans. And they also have Russell Gage on the roster, who was arguably the Ravens, uh, not uh, the Falcons' best receiver last year. And he knows the division. I think that was a very smart signing by the Tampa Bay Bucks, not knowing that there's going to be no Antonio Brown and the possibility of Grok not re-signing. I would love to see Gronk play football one more time, especially with Tom. I don't think it's going to be the same watching Tom Brady without Rob Gronkowski uh, alongside him. Um, so that's why I feel like Rob's going to come out still and play. That That's my personal opinion. Let me know down in the comments if you do agree with me or if you disagree with me. I'm open to a debate of what you personally think. When Derek Brooks comes out and says, you know, in a tw Gronk's not built for 25 weeks, he's built for, you know, 10 weeks. I think that's pretty spot on. 
uh, I believe was it week, I don't want to get this wrong, week five or week six when uh, he broke his ribs and it took him almost six weeks to come back. I feel like he doesn't want to deal with that again. I feel like he just wants to be able to plug and play week 10, boom, he's good. He doesn't want to do all the off-season workouts. He's not, that's not him anymore. He, he has like almost earned the right that he doesn't have to do these off-season workouts. But again, let me know down in the comments your thoughts. My thoughts is that Gronk is going to play half of this year and going to try to go back to the Bucks and try to make a, another Super Bowl run. But thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed these type of videos, uh, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more of these uh, NFL news type videos. And when the NFL rolls around, will be uh, game film, uh, game film breakdowns, and um, like player prospect uh, type videos where we kind of break down either some rookies or some very good players that'll be in the NFL. But thank you so much for watching, and it's your boy CJR Sports, and I'm out. Peace, guys.